Like, you love that character. Like, they might be the most, like, Straight diehard up. fans. You know what I mean? Like, everyone's got that one yeah. Sonic hat. You know the one I'm talking about? <laughs> yes. you, dude, you pictured it With perfectly. Spikes, yeah, I, yeah I thank you. Thank you, dude. It, dude. You all Yo, know that hat. Everyone's got, they got at least one. If you don't have one, you're not a real Sonic fan. In Brawl, they all hung out at events together, and they all had that hat. <laughs> what an great. easy way to meet up, dude. But Yo, you know the like cults within whatever community or, or society? Like That's one yep. of them, the Sonic The Sonic players. cult. Sonic <laughs> cult, yep. Here yep. we go. Oh, OK. Roxas is not Roxas anymore. His name is Alternus. So oh, he switched tags. Alternating okay. on the fly. We're going to. All right, we're rolling oh, with yeah, it. Right. We got to, we got to, the show must yeah, go on. Exactly. So Alternus versus 6WX. So the really tricky thing about this matchup for Sonic, wow, what a, what a nice little combo there, but he's going to get caught with the Witch Twist, pretty much tying it up right there. Very nice combo for Alternus. Um, but the tricky thing about this matchup is Sonic is a moving hitbox, and Bayo really likes that because uh, she has a couple answers to that, including Witch Time, which can, up, it can result in a KO. So Sonic has to be super tricky, super picky when he goes in, too. He does not want to get caught by any of those options, and 6WX doing a great job at that right now, Max. I think you could just spit bars on the mic because we're at a beatboxing convention. <laughs> good try, man, but speaking of... Ooh, I was going to say. I mean, I was going to let it fly, but I think I had to mention it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So but that's coming up later. Is that today? Is that tomorrow, the beatbox? That's tomorrow, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, it's tomorrow. Is it? Oh, okay. Yeah, well, tomorrow, tomorrow. Either way, 6WX climbing ahead Ooh. off to a pretty solid lead here. Got Bayonetta at those bloody percents she doesn't like to be at as a light character. But, of course, no number is safe. Right. She'll crack the code. She'll figure out the combination. Here we go, both these players, you know, understanding the importance of having a lead against the other character. Because as Sonic, you really don't. You want to have the lead, so you don't have to approach Bayo. And as Bayo, vice versa, dude, you really want to force Sonic to approach. So. Comes a grab though, good opportunity for, wow, he showed his hand really early there. Six just glide around him, but you know what? Back air, up smash mm. too, okay, very nice. Cleaning that one up, super clean. Uh, from the ledge right there from Al Turnus. Hardest part about fighting this character is that when her percent gets up there. <gasps> what about when the Bayonetta gets up there? <laughs> Six WX capitalizing, yeah. we'll be seeing you up air off the top, very nice. Gonna go for the heel slide. Basic opener into a frame trap, I like that from Al Turnus. just Alternating his yep. combos as well as the tag here. <laughs> Very true. Here we go. Six. Nice. Going for the grab, too. Already got Witch Time once. He's you know, not trying to have that happen again. That's the cool thing about hitting a Witch Time early in the set. Like, you know, your opponent's going to be looking out for it. So I'd like to see uh, Alternus mix it up a little bit more. He's going for a couple of these Witch Times. And right here, 6WX is really opening him up. Like in the cross-ups, though, making sure he stays away from that shield grab range 6WX has. Right there, you can see Six respecting Alternus right there. Going right around him. Didn't want to get Witch Time. Avoiding Witch Twist, too. Both these guys just trying to go for only retaliatory strikes, mm -hmm. letting each other close the distance first before responding. Bayonetta can sit back and shoot the guns to try to make up for some of this lead, yeah. but Sonic is just so quick that uh, improperly aimed guns could get him punished. Right. Or her punished, sorry. Yeah, yeah she, he's so fast, dude. That's the other thing. Here you go. Nice. See, exactly. He could keep up with the hillside, get a grab, too. No tech either. You got to tech that one. Little nudge under the stage, oh. but Witch Twist, so many hitboxes to protect you. 6WX already prepared for that immediate jump off the edge. Pretty much the go-to panic option at high levels in this current metagame. We're seeing yep. players come up with some really solid and premeditated answers to it, though. Exactly, especially Sonic. So you see that back air come out from all the top Sonics. Uh, Kels does it like a monster all the time, picking off people's jumps and six. Obviously doing it right there as well. Very nice job. I mean, KO options at the ledge from Sonic are essentially forward smash and back air, you know, trying to catch the jump or trying to catch the two frame or trying to get the uh, neutral get up. So very nice job by Six. He's going to take the game lead right now, Max. We're going to be going to town and city. This is winner's finals of pool C2 over here. Winner goes on to top 48. Loser's got to stick it out through one more set. Oh, no, they're going to the top 48 loser side as well. So right there, like a good thing to do if you guys are trying to work on the Bayonetta matchup, you can see Six, you know, he could, uh, Preemptively starts SDIing when he knows a witch twist is coming. You can see him. I saw, you can see Tweak do it with DK. So it's possible. That, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. No, that's gonna be off the top. Wow, Alternus taking a big lead right here. Town and City really working out for him in a big way in the first stock next. Sometimes you just reach a little bit too hard, yeah. and you gotta pay Ooh, the price. Dope. Bayonetta definitely a character who's gonna make you feel those mistakes. Wow, six is swinging. I like it. Oh, heel side. Oh, dude, if that da if it's sweet spot, I think he's still a bit fun. But he it would look cool. Going for it all right there. Wanted the game to be over. All right, fast forward to the third match. Don't give 6WX any time to adapt, figure you out, maybe sense some nerves here. If yeah. Alternate rushes this, that's the recipe for disaster. I was going to say, I kind of like these heel slides because he does have the lead, so it's a good risk. Here we go, hold on. Nice. Double ABK and he gets the Witch Twist. Nice. The up air, too. Not only does it rack up damage and push Sonic away from you, it lets you land safely. Very nice stuff. Alternus has really been impressing me with his staggered combos, his mid-combo resets. Never trying to take too much. Oh! Okay, he hit him with it. Okay, he 
<laughs> Talk about beatboxing, man. He was freestyling right there. I believe Alternate. my dude is good friends with Jackal. That's okay, Sonic okay. in Jersey. So I think they have plenty of experience doing <gasps> that to each other. Wow. Dude, that's, those shoes have deceptive range, range, dude. They hit you from all the way to the top. You saw Six get that first one, too. Got to be aware, man. You got to be ready for that one. Especially, like, if you have bats, the reaction is so good uh, with Bayonetta that you can avoid that. But here, Six, starting to get a bit of comebacks going here, Max. She's such a comboable character, too. Mm -hmm. See Six WX capitalizing on that. Leads to those up airs very well. Wow. What a grab. Uh, Alter is going all the way up, but great avoidance by Six. And he gets a grab himself. Oh, this is dangerous right now for both both players. <gasps> Heel side. Oh, he, the lean back on the heel side uh -huh, that got him out of that grab. Uh -huh. Super nice right now. Again, Alter is really going for these aggressive edge guards, and Six has been avoiding them really well. And now he's back in this game. He waits it out. <gasps> back air, not the good hit, though. Can't help but think that if that was a sweet spot, it would have sent her high enough to actually just kill off the top. It's very possible. Both players waiting out each other's options. Here we go. Spinning on the shield. Okay, you can see. Oh, dash deck. Alter is showing that he is aware, ready to do a witch time if Six spins on him uh, unsafely. Oh, oh, hold on. Field goal. No, it didn't. It's not good. It's not good. No good. Hold on. Wow. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Opportunist moment right there. 4-6. Gets a forward tilt of the ledge. Full rage on the Sonic now, Max. Let's see what he can find at the ledge. This is not where you want to be against someone like 6WX. Throwing out that back air, that forward smash. Such tempting hitboxes to go and challenge. But there we go. Forward throw. Going to close it out for Alternus. Sending this to a final round here to see who qualifies for the top 48 on winner's side. Bayonetta, a character generally favored to take it over Sonic. But yeah. you have to have nerves of steel and extreme patience to get through it. That's where 6WX's strengths are going to be in this set. And if he can pull it over on Alternus, then hey, credit to him. He's, he can't be feeling too bad about that game. He basically got, got he basically got caught in his first stock in a really bad position in a Bayonetta combo. And he died early. And he almost brought it all the way back, even though he had such a deficit. So he's going to be going back to town and city, like the stage for both these characters. FD transformation, you know, very good for Sonic. He can choose when he's going to go in. Bayonetta, though, loves the platforms. You can camp on them and combo off of them. So see what both these players can do uh, in this game three, Max. Alternus hopping around, Is that picking a bait? ambiguous spots to. I'm sorry? Was that a bait? Did he dash attack at the ledge and then just run off ABK? Was that a bait? We'll or is call it just it a, a, a lucky it break? <laughs> a lucky bait. Lucky bait break. Right, <laughs> but either way. Yeah, 6WX just making his way back onto the stage from the platforms here. He wants to hold down the center. Of course, the more room he has to run away, the more room he has to just do those shield canceled spin dashes. Can't wait for that to go. <laughs> and make, know, right? <laughs> make alternates come to him, pick up these shield grabs. Generally can get an aerial off every one, and if he just keeps chipping away at Bayonetta. <gasps> oh, the oh! double! Oh, the double. Yep, he's catching on to the SDI, making it really count for him. Very nice stuff right? Alternus. And now we're going to have to see Six make some magic happen here, Max. And it all starts with a witch twist. No, nope, not going to take that any further. Here we go. 6WX Ooh. still in it. That almost connected. That would have been one of the best Sonic things I've ever seen in this game. Absolutely wild by 6WX. You can see he's got a lot of fight left in him. Loving these frame traps. The back air to neutral air. Almost Ooh. killing at the top of the screen, too. Mm -hmm. Ooh, he sensed that heel slide. Just mm -hmm. didn't hold the forward smash. Exactly. Good grab here. Uh oh. Hold on, hold on. Okay, I was going to say. Oh, the duff. That's going to tie it up, Max. Okay, last stock situation. The crowd coming to life now, Max. It's all those specials, so much landing lag. Alternate is getting caught with it. Only a 50% deficit here for 6WX after such a brutal opening combo from Alternus, who I yeah. almost just called Roxas. This is really <laughs> impressive. Okay, here we go. Six holding the ground. Oh, oh he gets caught. Oh, uh, dude, his his SDI, you got to early, you got to do anticipatory, anticipatory SDI to avoid that. And you can see Six just getting one hit and getting out of it. But he also got. <gasps> See, no punish again. I feel like Six has had a couple openings here in this match, a couple whiff heel slides or witch times, and Six, no punish. I think he's respecting uh, Alternus a lot, which yeah, is if smart. I, if I'm Alternus, I'm not too afraid of throwing these witch times out. There's nothing Sonic can really do to kill you at 0%. He's a character who has to earn his way through this comeback hit by hit. Okay, nice. I like that. Alternus recognizing. Ran out. Hold on. Okay. He ran out of resources, so he went for the down air, which has a ridiculous hitbox, defending himself very well. <gasps> Wow, he traced him that whole way, dude. He was waiting for that 100%. Oh, the backers are coming out, Max. Sonic players do love going for that spin shot, down B with the C stick to propel you all the way across the stage. It's kind of like the Diddy Monkey flip of Sonic's, you know what I mean? You get exactly. caught in it. Oh. oh, but a witch time. Oh, through the air dodge. What does he have? No, manages to break free. Matrix, dude. He slipped by, right by that one, avoiding all the bullets. Here we go. Now six. Man, again, another opportunity. A little missed by six. The air dodge is there. Wow, waiting for it too, Max. Respected that witch time too much to even get a punish on it. We're seeing 6WX struggle here. 
This is not what Sonic excels at. He's so good at running away from you when he takes the first stock or gets a big percent lead, but making it back is tough. Dude, he threw Bayonetta off stage too. Oh, it's a witch time. That's it. What? what? Hold, hold on, hold on. That's still forward throw? Yeah, okay. that's still gonna do it. Okay, okay, okay. okay. I was feeling like little John for a second. <laughs> I did not know what to think. Dude. Alternus, reverse 2-0. That was really nice. Well played, dude. He played the matchup so well. Oh, the back air right over his head. Dude, he got, <laughs> got another one out too on his shield. <laughs> it's a good move. I know how they do in New York, but 6WXA and in Philly, we lean forward out of that toward, uh, back air. But either way, uh, it's going to be a 2-1 victory for Alternus.